Hey, did you see that? Did you see that armadillo? Saved your life, bro. Oh, maybe not. Oh, that alligator was the, uh... That was the super alligator of rain god. And I killed him, and now the rain stopped. What's up, Amazon survivors? This is kg 4 e and welcome back to my Let's Play for Green Hell. And I just want to let you guys know right off the bat, my next few days of videos will probably be quite obnoxious because I am in a great mood. It is Friday. Tomorrow is cheat day. Oh, I can't freaking wait. I'm so freaking hyped. Um, I hope I don't annoy you guys too much with my uh, sickening, sickening energy levels and happiness. Um, you know what? This rain, I'm loving it. It's not raining in real life, and I'm in a great mood, so let's do this. Okay, so I, sh I actually did something I said I wasn't going to do, and I actually streamed this world. That's right, guys. I streamed it live on Twitch. If you guys want to know about my Twitch, go in the description. Go follow me right now. Um, keep a lookout on Twitter. Keep a lookout on my Discord. Um, keep a lookout on YouTube. Whenever I do the uncaged updates, that's because I'm streaming. And you guys should definitely come check it out at some point. But I have... What? Wait. Wait. Why is it so laggy? Why is it so laggy? Why? Why is it so laggy? Oh, my God. It's a freaking pigsty. This place is a pigsty. There's stuff all over the freaking ground. Actually, I was kind of joking. The lag is actually not that bad. I just restarted my computer, and the lag is actually not too bad. I mean, I'm, you know, 20 frames a second is not bad if it just stays at 20 frames a second. Look at all this stuff. Look at all this freaking stuff, guys. You think I'm, you think I'm kidding? Do you think... Do, look, at, look at my face. Look at my face. Do you see how freaking serious I am? I mean, I've got full stick things over here. Full stick thing here. Sticks on the ground. Full thing of logs. A couple logs on the ground. I've done a lot of work. A lot of freaking work. Okay? So, what we're going to be doing today is we're going to be building. Last episode, I told you guys that I was going to go mess with the with the natives. And you guys said, Cage. 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 Cage, come here. Let me talk to you. And then I was like, what do you guys want? Well, what's the matter? I'm going to go mess with the, with the natives. And you're like, Cage. Cage, come here. Finish your goddamn house! Alright? And then I got slapped. Like that. And I was like, oh, all right. I guess people want me to finish the base. So oh, we're not going to finish the base today, but let's get a lot done. Let's get as much done as we humanly possibly can. Um, and that will be awesome. I went ahead and killed another um, Goliath. So now I have four Goliath dressings. Um, I just want to say right off, right on a little side note, um, whenever you reload the game, your bag here repositioning everything has got to stop. This has got to be fixed because this is frustrating as hell. You know, it's already bad enough having to play Tetris in here. Hey, you know, I don't need to be doing it every freaking time I start the game, right? I mean, come on, developers, fix that. Anyway, you might be wondering why my sanity's so bad. I had I had leeches on me like the whole stream, and I was just ignoring them like a dope because I just didn't give up. I didn't give a frig. You know, no cursing here, guys. All right, so. I told you I was going to be annoying. Don't say you weren't warned. All right, well, let's go ahead and do some building. That's what I wanted to do. By the way, I did get attacked by um, a couple Pumas while I was out there on stream. I didn't record it because I, I, I didn't die. Um, although, I guess if I died, it wouldn't have been on recording anyway, so you would have missed it. Um, I don't mind streaming, but I don't like streaming, like, combat and stuff, you know, um, without that being recorded because that stuff's exciting. So, um, I probably should have recorded it, but I didn't die, so, you know, no harm, no foul. You know, and, uh, yeah, just, I, I've deforested the entire freaking place, man. I'm telling you, I cut, we're going to go out and I'm going to show you what I did to the area, uh, at some point today. Probably have to go out and get some food anyway. I don't know. We'll see. But, yeah, for now, we're just going to be building. Building, 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 building. Cage the builder. Not Bob the builder, cage the builder. That's right. There we go. And let's go this way. So some of you guys said, like, oh, man, your house is so too big. Why are you making your house so big? Come on, guys. Come on. Is this, your, is this the first time you've ever seen my videos? And I'm not asking that to be a smartass. I'm asking that, like, legitimately. Is this the first time? Because one thing you guys got to know about me is I go big or I go home. Like, I'm not going to make some, you know, two-by-three shack that I'm going to have to, like, you know, be all cramped. In. No, I'm going to build big stuff. That's just the way, that's the way I do. And the developers of this game have gone on record as saying... We don't want you guys building big bases, so we're going to make it super expensive. And you know what I say to that? Bleep you. I'm going to make the biggest freaking base. I'm going to make my base twice as big now, just to, just because I, I can. Um, yeah, I'm not a big fan of, uh, oh, make your base small. No, no, nah, nah, screw that. 
Nah. Nah. That's not going to work for me. <laughs> I'm playing another game, uh, Seven Days to Die um, uh, Borderlands mod, right? And the developer there is like, you know, the developer of the mod is like, no, you're not supposed to make a base. And I'm like, watch me. You know, I'll go against the grain. I don't care. You don't tell KJ48 not to make a base. I'll make a base and I'll make it twice as big. Got the spider out here. Oh, I hear him. Oh, I don't like the fact that I hear him, but I don't see him. That's kind of creepy. Oh, there he is. Come on. I need dressing. That's right. Get, get over here, Goliath. By the way, that is an awesome name for a spider. I'm just saying. It really is. It is a Goliath spider. It's a Goliath bird eater. I mean, if that doesn't creep you out, like if that doesn't scare you, I don't know what to tell you. Like that is some creepy ass freaking spider name right there. Could you imagine? Like, oh, say to your wife, be like, hey, honey, there's a spider in the in the bedroom. Oh, really? Get rid of it. I guess she wouldn't ask what kind of spider, but if she did, be like, oh, do you know what kind of spider it is? And she'd be like, what? What kind of spider? It's a Goliath bird eater. And she's like, ah, we got to sell the house and move. Actually, I'd do that too. I actually like spiders in real life. I just don't like to see them. I like the idea of spiders. Like, I have a, I have a deal. Oh, well, let me take a drink of my uh, monster. I have a deal with the spiders that live in my, um, live in my house. If I don't see you, we're cool. But if I see you, you're getting squished and going in a toilet. You know what I'm saying? So... And the reason I like spiders is because they get rid of pests. Like, they get rid of, um, like, bugs, which I really enjoy. Uh, I don't, I'm a big, like, bugophobic. But is there a word for a bugophobic person? Like, there's arachnophobia, but is there, like, bugophobia? I don't know. Uh, probably, <laughs> it pro there probably is a name for it, but I'm sure it's not bugophobia. <laughs> yeah, there's got to be a name for it, but um, I don't like bugs, like, at all. Like, I have nightmares about them. I, one time, actually not one time, this has happened a few times. I've been sleeping in bed. You know, I go to bed before autumn, right? And I'll be sleeping in bed, and I'll have a dream where there's, a, where there's like a bug on me or a bug in the area or something with bugs, and I will wake up and jump out of bed. Like, literally, just wake up and jump out of bed thinking there's bu a bug on me and, like, just freak the hell out. That's like the lizard part of my brain saying, Hey! Hey! We don't like bugs! You know what I'm saying? And, uh, yeah, so that's, that's a thing with me. By the way, this is coming out really nice. This is my porch, just so you guys know. There's going to be a porch. There's going to be a ceiling on it, but there's not going to be any walls. All right, let's get rid of the rest of this stuff. we got to get stuff off the ground. Um, okay, so about my um, lag issues, okay? I was streaming this yesterday, and I was monitoring my computer in 50 different ways, okay? I was monitoring my computer's um, temperature. I was monitoring my computer's... Um, oh, there's no more stuff to put over here. I guess I could put some here, but I kind of want to leave those open for now. So let's do some roofing. Anyway, I was monitoring a bunch of stuff on my computer. And um, uh, I, my computer was cool. Like, really, really cool, you know? Um, there was well, there was one thing, though, uh, with this game that some people were telling me about. They, they had me go into um, the task manager. And they had me set it up so um, in the task manager I could see each one of my cores. I've got 12 cores in my, in my machine. Um, I think there's like six real cores, and then there's like virtual cores or something. All right, so I had 12 cores in my machine. One core was at, locked at 100% while playing this game, and the other cores were about half. So basically what the people in chat told me was that um, this game is not optimized to work with multi-cores. Most uh, indie, indie uh, titles are not, and that's where my bottlenecking is happening. And... Um, Basically, when I built my computer, I had two choices um, when it came to a, a CPU. Um, the CPU is the brain of the computer. It's the central processing unit. It's the thing that pops into the motherboard with like, all the sockets on it, you know? Um, and I, I had two choices. I could either go with uh, a CPU with less cores, but s more speed, right? I think my choice was a four core with like four, four gigahertz or whatever, or something like that. Or I could go with a 6-core where it was really like 12 virtual, something about, I don't know, um, virtually 12 cores, um, but really 6. But it was only 3.4 gigahertz. Is gigahertz the right word or is it megahertz? I don't know. Maybe it's megahertz. Anyway, gigawatts! Maybe it's 1.21 gigawatts! I don't know. Anyway, 
Uh, basically, the idea is I went with a slower processor, but one that had more uh, more cores, and that is supposed to be for multitasking because I do a lot of um, a lot of video video editing so software. I run a lot of stuff at once. Um, I wanted more, you know, bandwidth, basically. And that might have been a mistake because a lot of these early access games, and you guys can correct me if I'm wrong on any of this because I know you know a lot more about this than I do. Um, but it seems like most of the um, most of the games we play, or if not all the games I play on, you know, um, early access games, you know, indie games, they don't take advantage of the multi-core. So you have one core doing your entire game. And in that case, you probably want that core to be faster. So maybe I picked the wrong core. Maybe maybe that, that would have helped a little bit. Although the people in chat were telling me it might have helped a little bit, but not a ton. So who knows? Who knows with all this crazy computer stuff? All right, there we go. Grab some more of these wonderful, wonderful leaves. Okay. Man, we still have, we're still gonna need a lot of these banana leaves, guys. Man, going through so many. Get out of here, you freaking bird. Bird, bird, bird. Bird is the word. Bird, 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 bird. Bird, bird, bird is the word. So I, I mentioned that the other day, and I was like, "What? What is that from?" And you, you guys are right. It's from um, it's from well, it's, it's probably from a lot of different things. I know it from Full Metal Jacket. So, and that's what you guys said. And I was like, hell yeah, Full Metal Jacket. Well, the first half. I I wasn't a fan of the second half of Full Metal Jacket. First half, gangbuster. Second half, eh, not so much. Not so much. All right, we got to get that mud off the ground. All right, so let's come on over here. And this is going to be a solid wall, right? Yeah, we don't need two windows right next to each other. So, mud wall. That's a... I'm um, thinking window, window, or... See, the thing is, I want to put storage in here. Does it matter? I don't think it matters if you have windows behind storage, does it? I don't think so. I don't see why it would. So, let's go window. I like both of these windows, because like, right next to each other, because they look out on the lake. Or should we put a window here? I don't know. Let's finish this one, actually, before we go any farther. Bird, 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 bird is the word. Oh, God, I got that thing stuck in my head now. Come on, pick up the log, bro. That's right, you can't pick it up like that. Take three. Okay, let's go ahead and finish this one. These things are expensive as hell, by the way. Super duper expensive. But that's why I got a lot of sticks. They're super expensive on the sticks. Thank God I can put... Um, I can put bamboo walls on wood platforms, man. Like... Like, could you imagine needing 90 sticks for every freaking wall? That would have sucked. Shut up, you baby. Jesus. I think this guy gets some stamina by now. Oh, maybe it's because he hasn't... He hasn't rested in a while. and probably hasn't slept in quite a while either. You know what? Let's go eat some meat. That'll give me some uh, energy. And I, I probably need the protein anyway. Yeah, I definitely do. But before we get the meat, we're gonna... Nah, we'll just get the meat. It doesn't matter. Okay, eat. Oh, sanity. Oh, that gave me some energy. Oh, eight energy. Yeah, there we go. That's what I'm talking about. Oh, man. Let's go ahead and eat this as well. How are we looking now? Oh, let's eat the rest of the bananas to hell with it. My guy's going to be too full to move after all this. Okay, stop, Cage. Seriously. All right. So what we're going to do now is we're going to put this in there, put that in there. I know it's a little dark, but we're going to we're gonna sleep through the night pretty soon. Oh, that's way too dark. Can't have that. Man, I slept like a mofo. And there goes all my freaking um, food stats. Yeah, that's that's the name for it. By the way, this um this meat outside it's been constantly raining. I don't think this meat's ever gonna finish. Uh, it might even be broken at this point because you don't even see the thing around it. It might actually be bad. I might have to break that down. I didn't even think about that. Yeah, maybe I'll break that. Well, there's no point in breaking it down. Like that doesn't really help. But I don't think I'm ever gonna get any meat out of that. So we're probably gonna have to go get some more tapier thingies, tapier guys. Couldn't eat that. And let's take a look. We're looking good. We need some more fats. We need to get off the damn leeches. Freaking leeches, I swear. 
He could be used yeah. to him by now. You think at this point it would not mess with his sanity. It's like, oh, leeches again. You know, BFD, right? All right, um, what did I want to do out here? Oh, yeah, drink. I love the fact that it's raining. I can just drink with abandon. I don't have to worry about, like, conserving anything or, you know. That's really nice. I do enjoy that. Uh, what the hell was I doing? Oh, yeah, we're going to try and place a um, another theme of Bob here. Uh, da, da, da. Where are the frames? Where are the frames? Where are the frames? Yeah. Yeah, I mean, I mean, I didn't think I'd be able to put that one there. Can we put the wood one, though? Nope. Okay. Now we can put one there. I'm just going to put frames wherever I can. Because I can. <laughs> right? I'm just going to go with that that whole thing of... make this. Let's make this base as big as we possibly can. I could probably put one there. Maybe a couple over here. I'm just going to put frames everywhere on this whole freaking island. It's going to be awesome. This is going to be the best base ever, guys. It's never going to get finished. It's going to be so awesome. Alright. Why do you guys want me to finish the base so bad? Don't you like having something to look forward to? Once I finish the base, it's over. Right? Like, I don't I don't understand that mentality. I mean, like, I, I just... I want to keep playing, you know? I don't want to finish the base and be done. I don't know why you'd want that. I don't know. I just, I just find that curious. I've had that um, complaint in a lot of my videos. You guys are not alone. People are like, you never finish anything. And I'm like, hey. I mean, I get the idea of wanting to finish what I've already put down, but l like, let's make a big base, guys. Let's make a, let's keep this going. I like this game. I like playing it. You know, if I finish the base, then I'm like, okay, I got no reason to play anymore. Let's move on to the next game. And then people yell at me for not playing anymore. So we're gonna keep this. Uh, we're gonna keep this. You know, keep this show on the road. Keep this train on the tracks. Keep the show going. The show never stops. You ever see that? You ever see that movie? Um. Uh, Wolf of Wall Street, when Matthew McConaughey is uh, talking to um, uh, Jordan Belfer. Uh, oh, God, why can't I think of his name? What the hell? Um, I want to say Matt Damon. Not Matt Damon. Uh, oh, God, why can't I think of it? Seriously. Oh, wow. That was, that's a weird brain thing. You know, you know when you start thinking about something too hard and then you can't think of it because you're thinking about it too hard? I've just blocked myself. Um... Oh, it's killing me. It's killing me. Anyway, remember he's talking to Jordan Belfort and he's like, you know, the the the, the merry-go-round oh, is always going. It never stops. You know, it just stays on the rotation. You know, like that. Um, God, why do I want to see Emilio Estevez? What the hell's wrong with me? Um, oh, boy. This is going to bother me now. I'll just keep putting mud in there while I keep thinking about it. Get rid of this mud. It's a good idea anyway. Get rid of it. It's just in the way. It's making me dirty. Why do I want to see Emilio Estevez? What the hell's wrong with me? Here, hold on. Let me have another monster. See if I can think about it. Oh, this is really bothering me now. I know the guy. I know the guy. I'm just having, like, huge actor. You guys all know. I know you guys are all telling me in the comments, but... Am I really going to have to pause the video to think of this guy's freaking name? Um, Leonardo DiCaprio. Yeah, screw you, brain. You thought you won, but you didn't. Leonardo DiCaprio. It's kind of funny. I feel like I don't like Leonardo DiCaprio as a person, but I love all his movies. Why don't I like him as a person? I don't know. He just... I don't know. I, I, don't, I don't really know. I just kind of feel like I wouldn't like him. You know? You never meet your heroes. You know? Never meet your heroes. You probably won't like any of them. Alright. So should I put up this wall now? Or... Well, we can't put anything here. So this is definitely going to be walls. So we'll put these up right now. Bamboo wall. Bamboo wall. And this will keep going this way into another area. Get all this stuff off the ground. Okay. There we go. I'll have to stream this world again, by the way. I got a lot done. I mean, that's... I think me streaming this world made this video a million times better. You know what I mean? So that's that's really cool. I like that. I'm, um, I'm going to have to stream it more often. People seem to enjoy it, too, so... Should I make more 
like fires? Nah, I don't see any reason to make more fires. I could have like a second kitchen. Well, this is going to be storage. This is not going to be a second kitchen. So I will not put a fire here. But I'm thinking about putting a fire like farther down in the build and making like a second kitchen. You know? Maybe I should hire like butlers and stuff to like cook my food and stuff maybe. Nope, that's going to be a window. There we go. Yeah, that's nice. That is nice. All right, let's save the game. And then I'm going to take you guys out there and show you what I've done, you know, to the forest. I mean, the, the, the natives are going to come up and kick my freaking teeth. In. They're going to kick my cracker teeth in because, like, I just deforested this entire area, man. Like, and, and this, this one's not even bad as what I did over there. I'll show you over there as well. They're going to sick their alligators on me. And eh, maybe I didn't do that bad over here. But it's starting to get cleared out. See if we can find a came in to kill. We gotta get another tape here. Oh, hold on. Alligator. I know it's not an alligator, but I like the word alligator more than came in. Yeah, I don't like the word came in. I'm gonna call him an alligator. And the hell with anyone who says otherwise. All right, you. See if you can hit this chump in the head. Nope. Did not hit him in the head. Archery went up, though. Can I just shoot the ground and get my archery up? Or That'd be cool. I really want to get a tape here. So, I think we will make another kitchen. I, you know what? I'm not going to get a tape here. And you know why? Because I don't have any place to put the... Well, I could take the meat off the drying rack. Does meat go bad while it's on the drying rack? Because what I could do is, if the meat goes bad while it's on the drying rack, I could take the meat that's on the dry... Oh, I see you. I see you. Here's an arrow in your eye. Chump. Where's my arrow? There it is. Hey, did you see that? Did you see that armadillo? Saved your life, bro. Oh, maybe not. Oh, look. Oh, that alligator was the... Uh, that was the super alligator of rain god. And I killed him, and now the rain stopped. See? I Because I stopped the rain. That's right. Alright. Uh, what was I saying about tapir meat? Oh, yeah. I could take the tapir meat off of the drying rack and put the new tapir meat on there. But the thing is, if tapir meat does not go bad while it's on the drying rack, then I should just leave it there until I'm ready to eat it, right? You know what I'll do? I'll take one piece off today, and um, we'll see. If I take a piece off today, and it says like five days till it goes... Actually, let's just go do it now. Oh, I'm, I'm really curious about this, actually. Does it spoil on the drying rack? That's what I need to know. And I, I have decided I'm definitely going to make a second, a second kitchen, because I need another drying rack. That's just... I need at least one more drying rack. I, I guess I don't need a second drying rack, but I'd like to have one. Let's see if the stuff outside is... Uh, is still drying. Now, see that this stuff's. Oh, it's starting over again. Oh no. Yeah, that thing's never gonna. Well, maybe once the maybe once the rain season's over. All right, let's let's test this. What the hell? Why can't I take that one? Oh, it does go bad on the drying rack. Oh crap. I mean, it makes sense. Ah, uh, it sucks. Well, that, you know what that means? That means I could just get another tape here. We gotta make sure we eat these within 10 hours. Alright, let me show you what I did over here. <laughs> let me show you all the deforestation I did over here, man. Because this place is looking really barren. Look at this. Look at this. I'm so proud of my handiwork. Look at me. Look at me go. Screw you, Mother Nature! Don't run away. I need to shoot you in the face. I should probably take those back. Come on, where are you? Where the hell did you go? He might be caught in that rock. 
I think he's gotten caught in that rock before. I've chased this guy around before. Oh, maybe not. There he is. Now, let's see if we can get this guy. Man, they run for freaking ever. I should probably put a trap out here. Oh, there we go. Look at that. Huh? Huh? Oh, this is not tapir meat. I wonder if this is as good as the tapir meat. Yeah, we'll have to wait a couple days for it to dry. Cut. Cut. Ca ca cabra. Cabra? Cabra? I feel like I should know that word. Cabra meat. Maybe. Man, this stuff weighs you down. I'll bet you this is as good as the tapir meat. Because it's weighing me down like the tapir meat. Alright, let me go put this on a drying rack. Then we're going to do a little bit more building. Because I don't feel like I've got enough building done today. Alright guys, it's just 8, so it's time to get dirty again. And let's uh, let's build up some of these walls. Get this stuff off the ground, man. Because the lag... Actually, the lag has gotten a lot better. But when I first logged on, like, oh my god. You should have seen it the other day when I was doing this on stream. Before I got a chance to restart my computer. Oh boy. Oh boy. I can't really complain. I mean, I got like 50,000 things on the ground. I'm not complaining at all. I'm just stating a fact. A matter of fact. So this place is really coming along. Hells to the freaking yeah. Now, I do like the rainy season because it does make things a lot easier. But the thing that I hate about the rainy season is it makes getting screenshots a lot harder. And I know you guys don't care. You're like, whatever. But, you know, going through and getting those screenshots is such a pain in the ass. But, um, eh, got to do it. Got to do it, man. You got to get those sexy screenshots or people won't watch. They'll be like, what the hell am I looking at? I don't even know. You know? And then they just move on to the next video. So, and um, it's really hard to get the good screenshots in the uh, when it's raining. Really, really difficult. Okay. So, is this enough building for you guys? Let me know in the comments. Do you want to see another building video? Or do you want me to see me go out and screw with the cannibals? Uh, the cannibals, god damn it. Uh, go out and screw with the natives. Let me know. I'm good either way. Uh, I'll definitely do some farming off camera. Well, I can't promise I'll definitely do some. I'll try and find some time to do some farming off camera. Um, I don't stream. I wouldn't stream this again until next Friday. So, uh, that'll be tough. Or maybe next Thursday. Uh, so, you know, let me know. Let me know. I'll do another building video. I don't care. This is fun. I, I The building is the thing I enjoy the most. I just figured mixing it up, getting out there, getting, you know, seeing what's going on uh, would mix it up. But, yeah, people were not a fan of that. They were not a fan. Anyway, let me know either way, guys. I hope you ended up enjoying the video. And if you did, please remember to uncage that like button. Also, if you're new here, please subscribe for more daily videos. Thank you very much for watching. I'll see you next time. And until then, take it easy.